So this is just these Grand's Biscuits? Yeah, Grand's Biscuits. This is gonna be a nice snack for kids, for the family. I'm gonna add some marinara sauce. Just put a spoonful into each one. Okay. And we've got some more ingredients that we're gonna add. Can you guess? Well, I can guess because I can see it on the comment. <laughs> I'm guessing the uh, the next thing is probably uh, we are gonna add that right there buffalo mozzarella. Oh. I've already got some pre-sliced buffalo mozzarella. And they make that from real buffaloes, right? <laughs> yep, buffalo milk. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. It's a really All nice right. consistency. All right, so we've got our marinara, we've got our mozzarella. Guess what's next? Meatballs. meatballs and i'm actually using some chicken italian style meatballs okay that's weird gonna go right there are you gonna taste any different no they actually taste really good we've had these before they're good and it's healthier and in addition to the meatballs and these are frozen ones it's okay just put them right in there they're going to cook just fine in addition to that we need a little bit more cheese, cheese? actually i'm gonna get shredded cheese mozzarella that's in the fridge i can get that for you all right here we go mozzarella shredded cheese great boom we're gonna sprinkle some of this on top of these. Okay. And these are jumbo muffin tins. You're gonna need the jumbo size because we have so many yummy ingredients going in. Jumbo. After I sprinkle my shredded mozzarella, that's when I'm gonna add some Italian seasoning. And then we're gonna close this up with another biscuit and make a little sub sandwich pockets. It's All like right. hot pockets, but better. Sprinkle some Italian seasoning. Ooh, okay. Just a little bit. And if you want to add some spice, you could even put crushed red pepper, but this is just standard Italian seasoning. Looks good so far. All right, now I'm gonna take my other biscuits. Use my fingers to spread it out like this. Oh, so you need a real mm -hmm. thin layer. Yeah. So these are the Grand's Biscuits, but they're gonna go right on top. Look at that. Now I just press it down with my fingers. Okay. Look at how cool that is. All right, use your fingers, spread it out, press it down. These are gonna be so yummy. And when I cut them open at the end, you're gonna see all the yummy goodness. Can you, I'm gonna actually pop this one open, but all I'm right. kinda nervous. I, why guys, is this always so scary for you? Because these are dangerous. Somebody in the comments told me that it like exploded on somebody and actually caused damage. Yeah, okay, here we so, go. He says you poke, pop it right there. Oh, oh my goodness. How is that not scary to you? That is definitely scary. Okay. <laughs> so take okay. our biscuits, spread it out with your fingers. Uh-huh. Right over the top. Got it. This is gonna be so good. I'm actually really excited about this. People are always saying, you always make lots of breakfast and egg stuff. So I thought I would do something different this time. This could be used as a snack. This could be for lunch, dinner. This will be perfect if you have a big family. Perfect if you have a lot of kids. All right, it'll be exciting to see this when it mm -hmm. gets cut open at yep. the end. We're gonna put it in the oven and cut it open. But next I need some egg. There's an yep. egg. We're gonna crack this into my little bowl. Okay. All right. Egg wash. Ooh, I just thought of something else I should have had to this. What's that? Okay, so just do a nice little egg wash. And that, what does that even do? I don't even know. What it an actually egg wash gives is. it a nice golden color. Oh. I mean like the top? It's just I just when it when it bakes basically. Yes, right? okay. it, it it gives it a nice golden color. I see. Like a knife. Mm -hmm. nice. Yep. All right. One more. All right. Now I'm going to get fancy and I'm going to put a nice little grape tomato as decoration on top. Okay. We're just going to actually cut it. Be very careful. Just in half, right? Yeah. I'm just going to slice the top. Oh, I see. Just not that one. Okay, that one wasn't fancy enough. Mm -hmm. We're gonna okay. just put it right here on the granite. All right. Slice it just like that. I see what you're doing now. And look at that. Pretty, huh? Look at that. And right on top. 
trying to find the prettiest tomatoes to use for this. Can dogs eat tomatoes? Yes, dogs looking. can have tomatoes. I will give him a bite. Jax, come here. There he is. Do you want a tomato, buddy? Come here, buddy. Come here. Hey. Sit. Oh, he's a good boy. And look who else just came. Sassy. All right. Zero, sit. Good boy. They love tomatoes. It's weird. I don't even like tomatoes. All How's right. that looking? It's cute, it right? It's good. Press All it right. There. So next step is we put this in the oven mm -hmm. and then we uh, bake it for a little bit and then cut it open. And I can't wait to see what it looks like inside. Mm -hmm. So slice it open. This one actually looks good. I'm excited about it. You know, you could even dust some Parmesan cheese. Uh -huh. You didn't cut that one very good. No, I didn't. What are you doing? They're, they're kind of mushy. Okay. I don't want that one. <laughs> I won't give you that one then. There you go. All right. That's pretty enough, right? You look good. All right. All right. There you go. Let me clean this up because I want this to be clean. All right. All right, and right there, there we go. Look at how beautiful that is. I'm excited for these. We're gonna cut them open. You're gonna see all this yummy, cheesy goodness pour out. All right. And you know what? You could put whatever ingredients you want in here, but I'm going with like a meatball sub type thing with biscuit dough. Whew, looks good. Look at how good that looks. Oh my gosh, these turned out even better than I thought. They almost look like little pot pies, and it smells good too. You guys smell that? Yes, that does smell good. Look at how good this turned out. Okay, so we are gonna actually cut one in half now. Now inside of this, these are our biscuit dough. We've got our marinara sauce. We've got the mozzarella, buffalo mozzarella. We've got the shredded cheese, Italian seasoning, and our meatball. I'm gonna take this one. And what I really like about these silicone liners is that they make it so easy when you take it out. Watch this, guys. Look at that, look at that, look at that. It's like magical. It just pops right out. Look at how good that looks. This is a, like a portable little lunch. I love it. All right, moment of truth. We're gonna cut it in half, ready? We should see lots of yummy goodness in there. Meatball. Oh yeah, ready for this? Yummy. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to try these.